Good morning, everybody. It is 20 till 20. Redo. It's, it's 1041. There you go. I'm not even going to do this 15, 20 till. I can't function that. Um, after Skyping with a friend who has the same insomnia with me, I didn't go to bed till 5 this morning and woke up at 8. So I've gotten three hours of sleep. After I got off Skype, which was around almost 3 o'clock. And by the way, um, Mike, with the rain and everything that went through, it surged my power. And that's why the internet went right. Um, so I tried to Skype you back, but. I guess you went to sleep because I know you've got to get your son up for school. So, I, I didn't bother. Um, it is cold and it's rainy today. And it should be warm and rainy is what it's supposed to be. I'm battling a migraine I can't get rid of. I've had it since yesterday, uh, since I dealt with the doctors. And I'm just, I'm constantly taking the migraine prescription they're giving me. To try and keep it at bay. But after I got offline. With my friend. Mike. Um, I did stupid guys. And I got on Facebook. Now listen. This is my YouTube. And sometimes you know. It's not about lying. But it, I'll, I'll discuss that first. My arm. Ice cold. My head is. It's this side. And I mean, it's literally this whole side of my head. And I'm congested because of the rain and all that crap. I just, uh, I'm still feeling off. And I've been feeling off for about a week. But um, only certain people know why. Mike, you're one of them. Um, no, and my husband. I did stupid and I got on Facebook. And... There's some vicious, cruel people right down when it comes to your family that don't have any remorse for what they say. And it's not about my health, mind you. I wouldn't have cared. But I hate pity parties. I hate the world revolves around me, people. And oh, poor me. It's all about me, 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 me. I cannot stand people like that. And I'm not going into details, but a certain witchy person, Mike, you'll understand who I'm talking about, decided to make a horrible post about their father, my husband, and played the pity card, oh, poor me, all about me act. And I literally flipped the bitch switch. I don't, I didn't mean to, but I am very protective of my husband and what is said about him, especially when it's a lie. And you guys really don't know much about my family history or his family history of what we've been through. And I, I called BS on it. And it's like, I, I, I slapped I didn't slap them. I I literally slammed them for what they said. When they knew it was a lie. Of what they said. And it really aggravated me. And upset me. They. If we all. If you have somebody you know. Who is a drama queen. Or drama king. And it's all about drama. And all about poor me. You'll understand what I'm talking about. And they go to the depths of even hurting their own loved ones, their own parents. And they did that last night. And I cracked a whip and I went off. And this is around 4 o'clock this morning. And um, they weren't remorseful for their lie. But yet they felt guilty for what they posted on live Facebook for the world to see. That they recanted what they posted and erased it. But I know this child. 
I caught I, I copy and I posted it on my on my computer all the replies that were made about their posts plus their replies back to people because they thought they were gonna hide what they said so they could still get the happy birthday or I love you baby you're 19 you've got to start facing what you say and what you do you're an adult supposedly so act like one and I chewed on it and I chewed on it and I mean all through the night I chewed on it so I got up this morning I talked to my other children and they agreed to repost what was posted but give my opinion on how much of a lie that post was and to really tell the truth and I did and I posted all the comments that came behind the original post I didn't do it to be mean even though it might seem it guys but don't post something to hurt somebody viciously and then go oh I'm afraid that person I posted about is gonna see it so I better take it off otherwise you know they'll never they'll they'll think this of me I'm not getting into detail and I really I'm not going to so and I I did repost and I reposted the truth and I reposted the vicious BS lies that they had posted about because I've been there the whole time this child was since 10 years old so I've been there I knew what this child has put us through plus the other side of the family through so what they post and drama was not going to happen and you weren't going to use your pity card to have people bash your father and I reposted all the comments and I, I did place on there I know you, the mother is going to be upset that I reposted this but I'm not recanting and I'm not taking it off because it needed to be known that this child cannot get away as an adult as they claim they are post something so vicious and such a lie and untruthful to play the pity card and then get caught get slapped by it you know on Facebook corrected them and then take it off and think that everything's gonna be oh hunky-dory I'm tired my arm is just, I've got to go to Walmart today and pick up my medicines that the idiot didn't send yesterday I don't want to get out because it's rainy and cold and I sure the heck don't want to go to a Walmart I'm just glad the pharmacy's right there as I walk in the door um, my better half made note that he might come home tonight I'm awaiting that message because of the rain but at the same token he might not because they're the whole parking lot of a grocery store is completely <laughs> plowed up so he might he might not come home I'm awaiting that text within the next hour I've not took my medicines yet all I've been down while well, I took a muscle relaxer and a pain pill and I'm I'm eating these migraine pills like it's Tic Tacs because my head and I need to hunt down my children's allergy medicine because my sinuses are just blown up so yeah it's just I didn't sleep well those three hours and I feel overwhelmed I feel angry I feel fed up frustrated ready to give up just I feel not of normal sorts recently and it's just getting worse oh and I, I've not took the 100 milligrams of Zoloft this morning so I could take another 100 milligrams this afternoon I've not even took that yet so that's what I'm glad I'm posting now now I've got to actually do that too so 
I'll see how that goes. Until then, hopefully you guys are seeing sunshine and not the rain. Hopefully you're not seeing snow and you're seeing sun. Hopefully your day is blessed. And may you be at least let more or less pain-free than you were the night, day before or last night. God bless, guys. Sweet.